are in Rhodes and we're in a fun new town. Today we're going to Rhodes Town, so we're going to get the bus there. Um, I don't know what's there, but apparently it's a really nice old town, so I will take you along and we can see what is there. So the apartment isn't that great, it's alright, and the food isn't that good, but I'll show you outside, it's quite nice and sunny. So yeah, um, we'll take you along with me to Rhodes Town. Rhodes Town and it was nice. We just went around the old town, just had a look around and we're about to go for lunch but let me just show you this house because it's amazing. Look at that, I'd love to live there. Lindos, which is a town south from here. Um, it's meant to be really cool there. Apparently it's really hot. We get, we've been told that it's 45 degrees there, but I don't think I believe it. So yeah, we're just heading to get some lunch, and then we're going to get the bus, and then we're going to go to Lindos. And I'm just walking past where we walked yesterday. There was this little dog, and he was really cute. And I told him I would protect him, and then some dogs ran at him, and I ran off. So I wasn't a very nice person. So he might come out and say hello. I don't think he's here. And I called him Frank or Frankanopolis because that's Greek. But yeah, on the way to Lindos, and I will see you there. Another little swim. So I'll see. Uh, so I'm sick. On the boat because I got seasick. The boat driver made some nice dinner. The boat driver made some nice dinner. We had some bread for the fish. We had some bread for the fish. So I was staying there and thought. So I was staying there and thought it was a turtle. I don't think. I don't think it was a turtle. Some people thought it was a turtle. 
But it wasn't a turtle. What was it? Don't know, some weird little flappy fish. Like a turtle. It wasn't a turtle. Oh, and then we came back, at some dinner, now we're lying in bed because we're rock and roll. Oh. Aren't we? Yeah. It is about half eight. I'm probably going to read our books and go to bed. They're just a goat chilling in a tree. Chill it, bleh, bleh. A goat chilling in a tree. There he is. Just having a little mooch. Oh. So we've come to a place called Seven Springs. Took about three hours to get here on lots of different buses. And we don't know really what's here. But we're just walking through the woods. Everyone else seemed to have turned around before this part. So we could find something cool, but we also might find nothing. What? Yeah, it's quite pretty here. It looks like there used to be water here, but it's dried up. So we walked all the way to the top and I don't think there's anything else here, which is why nobody else walked up here. We just basically found some kind of weird farm like some grass there and some farm in the background. Yeah, there's nothing up here basically. So now we're going back down. So after all that walking, we found out we actually walked the wrong way. So we walked back on ourselves and now we found a spring. And this is it. It's not too spectacular, but at least we know we found it. There's some like cute frogs in the river or stream and massive, massive, um, what are they called? Dragonflies. And some huge tadpoles, there's a dragonfly. So yeah, at least we found it. It's a little froggy. There he is, Just having a little sit on a leaf. Going into a tunnel. So this is what was on the other side of the tunnel. But now I don't know where I am. Story. I came to the end of the tunnel and Richard wasn't there 
so I decided to wait there for about probably about 10 minutes and he came and turned up so then we decided to walk to the bus because it was about seven minutes to two and our bus is at two o'clock so we walked to the bus and I said oh I think I can hear a bus but we decided not to run because it was rocky and it was a little bit slippy so as we came around the corner we saw the bus and we saw the bus driving away so we missed the only bus back and now we are walking to the nearest town which is three kilometers away in the heat so it's fun times but as i came to the end of the tunnel richard said that he had gone to look for me and find me at the other end of the tunnel so he ran through the trees to follow the tunnel and get to the other side and i wasn't there and he thought stupidly nobody would go back through the tunnel the wrong way but I decided to go back through the tunnel the wrong way and we missed each other so now like I said we're walking three kilometers back to the town along the road so yeah fun times so just to end the story of today we carried on walking down the road and it was actually a really really long walk and about 10-15 minutes to the walk some random taxi just drove past us and beeped us so we decided to get in the taxi because it was only seven euros to get from where we were to the nearest town so we just got in the taxi and went to the nearest town we had some lunch and then we came home so all was fine in the end it was fine we didn't die on the little three kilometer walk um yeah so tomorrow is our last day we're just going to chill at the pool i think because we have to check out at 12 and then we're going to fly home and then that'll be the end of our holiday so yeah that's it